So I got my Costco membership card taken. Come here. Everybody wanted an explanation, and I'm going to give you one. So Costco wasn't too happy with the fact that I went to go buy mac and cheese, right? However, when I showed them my membership card, uh, the picture that I took, I didn't have my beard. Therefore, the person that was at the register didn't believe that it was me. Therefore, they didn't let me buy the mac and cheese. I had to put it back. So my response was to share the mac and cheese recipe with everybody. Well, that person not only saw the video, well, I believe he held a grudge because I went back to that Costco, same person, he took my membership card and he said, how do I know it's you? I said, we have literally already done this. Do we, can we not do this today? And he said, well, what if I don't want to give you back your card? And I said, you know what? You keep it. You keep it. I said, you want to know why? Because I want you to look at that picture and know exactly who shared the churro recipe that you guys had. And he said, did you share the churro recipe? And I said, not yet. You want to boil 250 grams of water. After it's boiled, you want to add 12 grams of vegetable oil, 4 grams of baking powder, a half gram of salt, 150 grams of flour. Then you want to put it in a piping bag, cut a hole in the corner, and then fry pieces of churro. Then you want to mix it together in brown sugar and cinnamon and make your chocolate sauce, which is just heavy cream and dark chocolate. Also, for their pizza, they cure their dough in canola oil, just in case you want to do some pizza to have fun.